It is Monday night once again, and we are in the Madhouse with the Mavic Soul Hour with Tommy Marr. We got some great guests for you tonight. I'll tell you that about that in a minute. But as usual, we're going to go through the week. I hope that everyone had a great Fourth of July and a safe one. And I hope nobody's fingers got blown off or anything. Hope everybody had a good time. It's like scorching hot in New York. It's crazy. Um, I want to thank my guests from last week, Motown and Moore, Vinlo Odom and the gang. You guys were phenomenal. Um, I think the sky's the limit for you guys. You're off and running. And uh, thank you very much for coming in. You guys were really, really, really good. Um, I was going to talk about my partner, partners, Tom and Vicky, who were in Niagara Falls for the last five days or whatever it was. And, um, but they just walked in. So we're glad that they're back safe and sound. So welcome back. I hope you're nice and rested and you had a good time. And um, they were in Niagara Falls. I don't know what they were doing, but they were doing something up on the 50th floor overlooking the falls. I saw some videos. It was great. Um, I also want to uh, talk about this coming Friday night at the Dix Hill Center for Performing Arts. Um, Amber Ferrari with the uh, J Joplin's Pearl is going to be there, along with the um, Clapton Chronicles. So um, Amber called me again and um, asked me to come in and do a tune with them. So you're going to have a little Joplin, a little Clapton, with a splash of caca. So it ought to be good. If you don't have tickets for that show, get them. The Dix Hill Center for Performing Arts, that's Friday night, this Friday night, July 12th. So don't miss that show because Amber is amazing. She is just an amazing vocalist and performer. She leaves it all on the stage, and it's just, like, you got to go see it to believe it, really. If you're a Joplin fan, you've got to go. Um, I also want to send out, we have gotten such a response, i got to tell you something, from Australia. Uh, in the last, I would say, five days, I could not even possibly tell you the amount of emails and uh, things that we've gotten from Australia due to uh, one of my guests two weeks ago, Tom Ghent um, from um, Nashville. Tom, you are just a blessing to us all. I can't ever thank you enough, but I do want to give a special shout out to Mark Eckel in Australia. Um, actually, last night we were home and we were just listening and I saw um, Tom sent me a little thing. Um, in a, in, a, in a blog, I guess, or whatever you want to call it. I, what do I know? But they were talking back and forth, and um, they actually had a, um, a dedication to my show on the number one station in Australia. So we have a lot of fans in Australia. I just want to give Mark Eckel a shout-out. You are number one in my book, my man, and you can, he is on Hot FM 106.7 in Australia. So pick him up because he's a great guy. Great guy. And uh, when you come to the United States, you come on my show. I'd love to have you. Also, I want to just give a, I got to tell you, this guy, and actually, Greg, you could tell me, speak for this guy, Rich Balta, who is a rock photographer. This guy does phenomenal work. Any of you bands that are out there that you want to be photographed by one of the best around, Rich Balta, get on him. Get him because uh, I'll tell you something. He does all Ambers. I mean, he's, he's, he's shot great. you guys before. He's, he's real and a great, great guy, too. <laughs> really super great guy. You can reach him at rbalter, B-A-L-T-E-R, photo.com. That's rbalter, B-A-L-T-E-R, photo.com. So you guys on the island or in New York or wherever, Connecticut, whatever, Shelter Island, whoever's in the vicinity, you need a great photographer, He's your man, Rich Balta. Thank you, my man. You really, are, you're a good guy. And even Michelangelo's here to back me up on that one too. So, um, Rich, you're the best. Thank you. Um, and I just want to say about the shows that we had while Tom and Vicky were gone Friday night uh, and Thursday. Uh, we had uh, four great shows. Uh, we had uh, um, Vinny and Janet's show, which was a uh, I don't know how to pronounce the show, but a great show with a great jam band they brought in. Uh, they just threw it together, and I'll tell you, these guys were great. I mean, they were really pros, came in and killed it. And then we had Christine, Christina with the uh, Martini Garden show, phenomenal again. And then Saturday, I got to tell you, this is probably my favorite show that, of any shows in Madhouse. Crick 
Chris Monty came in. He's a, a, well, a well-known comedian on Long Island and throughout the country. And uh, he brought in Joey Cola. He had, um, it, it was just a phenomenal show, I got to tell you. Thanks, guys. And Joey Cola, you are my favorite comedian. You are super, super, super good. And uh, I am going to have you on the show and can't wait to have you here because you, my brother, are one of the best I've ever seen. So that's about it for now. Uh, we'll, be gonna, we'll take a quick break, and I'm going to come back, and I'm going to introduce you to a bunch of friends of mine here from Long Island with a great band, and you are going to hear some butted up soul right here. So hang in there, get yourself tight, get yourself right, and you know where you're supposed to be on Monday night, right here with the Maverick Soul. We'll be back in a minute. <laughs> Hey, I'm Tom Mealy from the Harrison Law Group. You know, soft tissue injury, that's no joke. This is what we do. We're not new at this game. Don't waste valuable time going to firms who don't get it and can't do it. Call 1-800-INJURY-LAW. Uh, hmm. uh, Ray, I don't know. Are you sure clicking this thing will get us online? Well, try dragging it. Hmm. Faster. You're just a mouse click away from a better way to rent movies. Blockbuster Total Access. Movies through the mail plus movies through the store. One low price. Here's the problem. We what? forgot to plug it in. Oh, don't even think about it. Get a free trial at your Blockbuster store or Blockbuster.com. This is Beth. Hi. Hi. Oh, congratulations. When are you due? I'm not pregnant. Oh, look at that. Excuse me. You're totally thin. You look very sexy. For life's bleachable moments, all it takes is three quarters of a cup. Brooklyn's best locksmith and hardware. We have three of the largest showrooms of safes on display and in stock. You can see and touch them in person instead of browsing a catalog. We carry gun and rifle safes, burglary safes, jewelry safes, Fire rated from a half hour to two hours. Famous name brands. We sell guard all. We sell AMSAC. The new AMSAC touchscreen. If you're ever in need of a safe, think Brooklyn's best, Locksmith and Hardware. Right, Lockie? That's right, Alan. For professional motorcycle transport and towing, think Kickstart Fabrications Motorcycle Towing. Proudly serving all of Long Island, we feature expert handling and 24-7 service. So send a limo for your toy with Kickstart Fabrications Motorcycle Towing. We are back with the Maverick Soul and here in the studio in the Madhouse quarters right here. And I want to introduce my very delightful band in here tonight. They're a very well-known band on Long Island here, and they played all over the place. They're, uh, they, they had that Motown thing going, some R&B, some funk. They do it all. They, I've seen them. They're great. I, uh, uh, all you venues on Long Island, get a good look when they get up to play because you're going to want to hire these guys. So uh, I'm going to introduce them right now, ladies and gentlemen. My pleasure, Buttered Soul, right here. And starting with... Lead vocalist, <laughs> Greg Hopping. Now, um, next to Greg, we have Gary Mag Maggio, lead guitarist. Next to him, we have uh, Rick Rosenthal, bass. He actually looked like that bass player from the Blues, Blues Brothers. <laughs> <laughs> He's supposed to do the show, too. And then we have uh, Mr. Oh, we have Mikey Vitale. <laughs> The quiet one. Yes. That's oh, yeah, and he's, he's real quiet. <laughs> last but certainly not least, we have Sam Bryant, percussionist drum. Thanks. So, guys, talk to me. What are you up to? Uh, you know, we're having some fun playing music. You know what I mean? You, keep, you guys keep very busy, though, right? Yeah, we're pretty busy. You know, we're as busy as we want to be, you know. You know, we could be busier. Right. But, uh, you know, we're just having fun, man. Well, That's actually, what music is all about. You know what I mean? Yeah, I do. Music is from the soul. That's in your in the, in the name of your show. 
Oh, you guys are Maverick Souls. I can see that. How about the young guy here? I'm pretty, pretty he's soul. Why are you the wild one over here? He's yeah. up in the air. Yeah. I'm see being, if he's I'm a being Maverick. Um, he has a soul. Now, see how these guys come in with, they got the look, they got the glasses, they got the Maverick thing going on. You know, you He hasn't see. sown his soul oats yet. <laughs> his Ooh. Maverick soul oats. There you go. On my way. He's still working on that. <laughs> but now, uh, did you, you, who was the original, how, how did this, how did you guys get started? Oh, man. I've been at this with this band for about 10 years now. Really? And it started with some guys from uh, in uh, Spionk. And uh, then Rick came into the band. And uh, so it's, we're, we've been in the band the longest, me and Rick. And then uh, this year, you know, we, we played with a bunch of guys, Joe DeMeo, Bobby Mondinelli, you know, right, you know sure. a, a lot of really good guys. Um, this year, uh, Gary came on board uh, playing guitar. <laughs> And uh, I met Sam at Pete's place in, um, over here in Bohemia. And, uh, you know, I heard him play, and it, 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 he's unbelievable, man. So, you know, uh, I tracked him down through, uh, what's that website? We, we, <laughs> um, I forget the website. It's where business guys go. Oh, LinkedIn. 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 Oh, I, I, can't, I can't remember. My, I got a million come, people wanting me to do that. And I can't re get, remember my password, and there's no way of getting my <laughs> yeah, password. Yeah, me too. <laughs> and, it's, and, I, and it's really like I feel bad. I like, feel like, like who does this guy think he is? Because I would Come like on. to, you know, I don't you know, know what the hell it is, but <laughs> I want to say yes to them anyway, you know. But I, I, I can't even tell but you But you can't. Many. So can't. he was just coming off a tour in, uh, in South America, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So uh, when he came back, he's like, I'll get in touch with you. And, you know, he's been playing with us. And Mikey... Mikey's been like in and out of Buttered Soul for a while. <laughs> you know, he, he went to college, so, you know, he left us for a little while, but he's back. And uh, like I said, we're just hanging out, having fun, man. Mm -hmm. And like I said, that's what music's all about. Yeah. If you're not having fun, don't bother. Yeah, and it's not, oh. it's not easy to have fun nowadays. In, Sometimes it's not, it's man. Not, it's you not know? so much the band. It's the, it's the venues nowadays. Yeah, it's, it really it's is. It's like these guys, they just think... Uh, you know, how many people can you bring? How many? That's all you hear. You know, and I, I don't all, understand. There's it, not man, a band know? on Long Island. I don't care who they are. I mean, there's there's two I can think of that can bring a crowd every time. But yeah, right. No one can guarantee you anything. Not no. really. And uh, and it's a stupid question to ask a band. You know. Yeah. It, it really, really is. is. And you, it's a two-way street too. They don't even want to do any publicity well, or they advertising. Gotta, they gotta they do want their you to own do stuff. it all. Yeah. You know, it's really changed for the worst. They got to do and, their own stuff. You know. Yeah, and, and, and then you put 300 people in a place they want to pay you 150 dollars. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> the registers ring in, and the, yeah. and the, the cash is coming yeah. in. And, and like we're not, yeah. we're not 20 year olds. I mean, we could sit. I mean, I know I could. So I don't drink. So I mean, I worked yeah, in bars yeah, my yeah. whole life. Yeah. But I mean, I could t tell you almost to 100 dollars how much you put in that drawer, uh, absolutely. especially when they're eating in that. Right. And then you tell me you didn't put nothing in the drawer. Yeah. Yeah, because, you know, when we were young, everybody was drinking. But yeah, now, who cared? now everybody's eating, you know. Right. We all play in restaurants and people right. come eat now, right. you know right. what I mean? It's different. And they drink <laughs> club sodas and Cokes, you know. Yeah, but right. I do exactly. understand that end of it, too, yeah, yeah, because yeah. with the Dewey's and that, it's a different, different world out oh, there. Oh, it you know? absolutely and, is. And uh, I understand that, too. But when you're packing a place and you're seeing people eating and you know they're drinking, and a lot of times, you know, you still got a lot of drinkers and they're pounding them down and whatever. Come on, man. Don't tell me you put $200 in a drawer. That's you know right. I mean, it's... Well, what right. they seem Not to cool. overlook in, in the scheme of things is the years and years of practicing and, and rehearsing and, and all the time that goes into reaching a, a certain level of proficiency, and nobody cares about that. Right. You know? Well, I guarantee you, and I, I'm sure you, each one of you can vouch for it. I mean, especially if you do drink in the, while you're playing, I guarantee you usually spend more money than you, than you make. We generally, oh, yeah. Yeah. We generally don't drink when, yeah. when you know, we're and, uh it's like if you buy a meal or something, you know, for you and your wife, and you know, right. and then it's you made half of what you yeah. went there to do. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> so, true. but but that's why I say you got to have fun. Right. We but always show up to play. It's it's that's yeah. what I'm saying. It's harder to have fun. You know. Yeah. Like, you know when I have the most fun in the studio, that's when I have my most fun. Yeah. When you just don't care and you're just creating and having fun and you with guys that you care about, you know, that's what it's all about. It's what you know. How many can you, and, and you're up there singing and you're like counting heads, you know, there's a lot of people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It like takes it out of you too. Or you have a really great night and there's only like 30 people showed up, you know, and right. it's like you, you have them on nights when that happens, right? Right, right, right. right it's right. like, damn, why couldn't that have been the other night when exactly. there's 300 people in here? There's a lot of emotion in music. Yeah. You know, a lot yeah. of emotion. W without a doubt. There yeah. should, you know, actually, 
there should be more emotion because I think we've kind of left that a little bit. You know, you, you think oh, of James yeah. Brown and Janice and, you know, I mean, they would be Kaka. I mean, they, they would be, the energy would be running through the, and I, I use Kaka and Janice as a, a great example because if you watch anything like from Woodstock or anything with Janice or Kaka, they, they would actually be levitating on their toes because it just had nowhere else to go. It's from the know? soul. Yeah, and, right. it was just, and I'm sure you've had that. I've had a few, few times, not many, but I mean where you're just like euphoric, you know. And it's, well, sometimes you get into that. Yeah, and, and, it's, and, but it's a great feeling. And, and you, you forget where you're at. Yeah, <laughs> but that's when, that's when it gets good. That's when, yeah. it's, that's when it's fun. That's when you're in the zone. Yeah. You, you get yeah. into this zone. And but now, I mean, nowadays, out. I mean, the music is just it's, it's canned. It's just the vocals are not real. I mean, you know, nothing's real. You have you know? to be great on, on your computer equipment to be a good musician yeah, these days. Yeah, and it's sad. It's really sad because there are, and I mean, Long Island is. I mean, I guarantee between the six of us, we could name a thousand great, great musicians. Lots Long of great Island. musicians. Oh, sure. A thousand. I mean, Thousands. Great. Not good. Great. Great. Right. And uh, we'll never be heard of. Right. You know, it's yeah. sad. It's very sad. And then you got people, I won't mention names, but, you know, they got that. Them vocals are wah, 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 you know, like, and they're making millions and millions and millions auto of tune. dollars. Yeah. I Which mean. reminds me, you got my <laughs> auto tune set up over here? Got that auto tune set up? <laughs> no auto tune, but it's all, baby. Yeah, yeah. That's right. Turn it, it off and go home. <laughs> what you see is what you get. <laughs> you going to do that? Wah, wah. I don't know. <laughs> you guys are funk. <laughs> um, yeah, it's kind of changed, and uh, and I, that's why I like having guys like you in here because you are the real deal. You're the heart of what, where where the music comes from. You know, I can see it. I can even when you were just you know uh, testing here. Uh, you know, it's it's not something you can hide. You know, it's it's the real deal. You, you and, either uh, have it, right? You have yeah, it or I mean, you don't. I I I don't. I wouldn't bring bands in here that you know aren't. You know, that really because you know. Have it here. <laughs> yeah, I I think I do, and. Uh, I like to share that, and I like to show off people like you guys that now, I mean, right now we're in probably 100 countries, you know? Which you know? reminds me, let me say hi to Norma and Nat Hopping in Australia. There you go. There you go. To our uh, Australian crew. My, uh, my family over there. Are they, are they listening? Are they uh, watching? Said, I, I guess. I, I told them to watch. Oh, good. So they, hopefully they're watching. It's probably like what, sure 3 in the morning or 2 in the yeah, afternoon or something. No yeah, <laughs> 10 o'clock <right>. somewhere. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's a weird time. But uh, we do have a lot of people in Australia watching, that's for sure. And the oh, afternoon. Craig, Craig the cameraman's talking now. Listen to this. Oh, hey. <laughs> Craig Hudson from Australia. Oh, yeah? Craig Hudson. All right. Hey, so Craig. Hey, Craig. Hudson. What's, What's up, Craig? Craig Hudson. Saturday. Craig Hudson. <laughs> <laughs> what up with it? I hope you're listening to uh, 106.7 FM over there in Australia. <laughs> Hell yeah. So, where are you guys playing? What, what do you got coming up? We'll be at Port Jazz on Friday. Oh, in Port Jazz? Yeah. And, uh, you know, if anybody wants to, you know, go to the website, you know, buttedsoul.net. And you have a Facebook page also, Yeah, right? Facebook too, yeah. But Butted Soul. Butted Soul Group, yep. So definitely, and definitely all the all the up. dates are on there. All the show dates. If you click on the show dates button, all the show dates are on there. There you go. So yep. that's where we that's where you hook up with these guys. And I'll tell you, um, you're really going to enjoy these guys. I'm telling you because they are, but it's soul. Like you know, Maverick soul, but it's soul. I like it. I like it. I like it. Little Maverick with some butter. So, um, Gary. Yes. How long have you been playing the guitar? Uh, 30 years, three years, and 30 days, and like 10 hours now. <laughs> That's, this is our, uh, our, our Quirky Lang, uh, Roger Daltrey That's lookalike me. here. So, Full uh, energy drinks a day. <laughs> <laughs> I've played a long takes. time, Tommy, a long time. No, but I mean, yeah. I've seen you play. I mean, I, I know you're another guy who plays from your heart and soul. Yeah. And um, I mean, you agree, you agree with the way the music is now? I, mean, it's I do. It, I <laughs> To a point where uh, it's, I, sickening. it's sickening. It's sickening. I mean, the way you know you the what you know of the the real players out there, uh, the real bands out there that play from the soul. Um, you either have it or you don't. Right. You know, and they show up and they play and they kill it. And, and it doesn't matter what's going on, but as soon as they hit the stage, the switch is on, yeah. and you don't know what's going to happen, but you know it's going to be good because it's from the heart and it's you're all you're all in. I, I I can't even explain it. It's just something comes over me and us. Chemistry. It's chemistry. It's chemistry. 
Mm. And it's, it's great. I mean, that's why I still do it after all these years. And um, I love it. I love guitar playing. I love rock and roll. I love, you know, this, this band is great. It's a great fit for me. And um, well, I've been playing just, a long time. You brought up a good point of fit because, I mean, I've been in a ton of bands too. And, you know, there's usually one guy or, you know, something that's out of whack that's not making it fun and it's not, you know. Yeah. But it's so great when you do get a group of guys that have the chemistry yeah. and just, you know, you don't have to talk. You just know. You know where he's going. He knows where you're going. Yeah. It's just that's the fun part that's, too. That's you know? the fun I mean, part. That, that's the the soul part. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know. Yeah. So yeah. I, you know, I I, um, I spent the first half of my life just playing for a right. living and uh, touring and um, and then I uh, I went back to school and um, I'm in technology and I play and and uh, I make it all work. I See love that, it. But that is why I like having guys like you on the show because I mean. I, I, you know, I don't think people that, that I'm not talking about musicians or yeah. people who follow musicians, but just the, the regular public that does, they don't, they don't hear of all these great, great bands. I mean, yeah. they, they don't know that they probably two blocks from their home is a great band playing there, you know yeah. what I mean, on Friday or Saturday or yeah. Thursday or whatever. <laughs> and that's what we're trying to do here is yeah. we're trying to open the doors to all these people that, yeah. you know, you just don't know. You don't have to be at the Madison Square Garden. I mean, you don't have to do that. You can go to a little gin mill and hear great music. And you're going to see I mean, guys that put thousands of hours into their craft right. and, and show up and give it their all. Right. You know, all in. doesn't matter if it's a, you know, 20 people in the club or, you know, 1,000 people at the Paramount or right. 89 North or, or wherever from Long Island. We're from right. Long Island. But, you know, we're like, going to kill it every like, time. Like we go down once in a while. Like, you know, I know he plays once a month down at the Blue Parrot, a little tiny place. Yeah. I played there probably more than anybody's ever played there. Yeah. And, but, I mean, Randy Jackson from Zebra plays by yeah. himself there. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, you can actually walk in there and sit three feet from Randy Jackson. He plays the 12th. Day. This guy has a show that yeah. is amazing. And he's got, he tours a lot. He is amazing. Amazingly I talented. never realized how great of a singer and a guitar player this guy yeah. is. And he does all the Zeppelin. It's incredible. Incredible. I mean, and you, what does it cost you? Eight dollars or something? I mean, exactly. this, is, this is what I'm saying. I mean, so like, you guys can go and you can see a band like this. For like five dollars to walk in the door, rather than I think we just we saw Fleetwood Mac in uh, four thousand dollars a seat. I mean, it's crazy. It's nuts, nuts. I mean, I'd rather go see Bud and Soul. I really would. <laughs> I really would, because I mean, I'm not getting crushed, and I mean, I'm, I yeah, can really right. hear you. You yeah. know, I can get up close and personal. Like you know? most of the places we play are, there's no cover. You right. Know what I mean, right. almost all of them. That's great. That's what I'm saying. I, I, that, that's the word we want to, because I believe, I, I truly believe that right now, the mecca of music is on Long Island. I truly, truly believe that. Incredible it's talent so, here. Yeah. so many. Absolutely. So, so much. much. And I want to expose as many as I can, and that's why we have you guys here. We so, appreciate uh, it. We're glad you're exposing us. Thank you. Yes. Well, I heard <laughs> we like to be great. exposed. I heard that you'd like to expose us. <laughs> oh, my. I see his wife back there, like, crow! <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> We're going to take a quick little break. We'll be right back. Hang in there. Get yourself tight. We'll be right back with Budded Soul. When your cable's on the fritz, you get frustrated. When you get frustrated, your daughter imitates. When your daughter imitates, she gets thrown out of school. When she gets thrown out of school, she meets undesirables. When she meets undesirables, she ties the knot with undesirables. And when she ties the knot with undesirables, you get a grandson with a dog collar. Don't have a grandson with a dog collar. Get rid of cable and upgrade to DirecTV. Call 1-800-DIRECTV. When your cable company keeps you on hold, you get angry. When you get angry, you go blow off steam. When you go blow off steam, accidents happen. When accidents happen, you get an eye patch. When you get an eye patch, people think you're tough. When people think you're tough, people want to see how tough. And when people want to see how tough, you wake up in a roadside ditch. Don't wake up in a roadside ditch. Get rid of cable and upgrade to DirecTV. Call 1-800-DIRECTV. When you pay too much for cable, you throw things. When you throw things, people think you have anger issues. When people think you have anger issues, your schedule clears up. When your schedule clears up, you grow a scraggly beard. When you grow a scraggly beard, you start taking in stray animals. And when you start taking in stray animals, you can't stop taking in stray animals. Stop taking in stray animals. 
Get rid of cable and upgrade to DirecTV. Call 1-800-DIRECTV. Huntington Toyota, the experience of a lifetime. Don't take our word for it. The experience for me at Huntington Toyota made me feel very comfortable. It's their professionalism, their honesty, and their integrity. I've bought at least nine or ten cars here at Huntington Toyota. They give me the best price around. It never was about high pressure. It never was about them. It was always about us. Today's cars are very similar, but Huntington Toyota is very different. Huntington Toyota, where it's all about you. Like Ed what? Are we are back with the Maverick Soul. So here we are with Budded Soul. <laughs> right. And they, and they, and this, this is amazing. They didn't even put up the applause sign. It's amazing. It's, it's up all the time. I though. know. I know. <laughs> it's just there. Um, so let's go over to Mr. Rick Rosenthal. Talk to me, man. It, it's all about the music. He, he reminds it's, me of Ed Mozel too, right? You know I don't even Ed know Ed Mozel. You know Ed Mozel? He doesn't no, know. Oh, you look. You could be his brother. Know. Really? Yeah. Uh -huh. And you could also be uh, the guy from the Blues Brothers, uh, the sax player. Oh, I know actually, they're supposed to be on on the show. Uh, they're playing uh, the living room or something. He, he stole my look. I think he did. Yeah, he did. I think he did. I think I was there first. You were. Pretty you know, depends on how you know how old he is. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I do. I do. <laughs> Well, we've been around. We've been, <laughs> yeah, we've been around we've the been block around. a few times. Yeah, we know it's. So you're happy and, and everything's cool with the chemistry and the. Oh yeah, you know the best part of this is just the, these guys. You know, yeah. They're just uh, when you it's get good, out it's with good. guys it's that you like and you like to play with, and and it, it's just all there. What could be better? Yeah. So how is it with the uh, with the uh, underling in the in the band? Well, this has young he man been <laughs> the has he been behaving himself. He's what? a lot of fun. He he bring he brings energy. Mr. Mikey Vitale. I keep rehearsals nice and bright. He does a good mark. He's a diva, though. I got to tell you, we had the test. Ah. Going. We had a little you test know, going. You know, you get, you get picky like that when you when you run a show over and over and over again. I don't. Again, I don't you know? give a shit. And, you, and you, just, you just want that particular. No, know? I I appreciate it. I'm There's only nothing too jobs. nitpicky if if you think it's for the good of the you sound. And that's what's part. most important. He does a good Marv. Yeah. From family, yeah. Mort, you mean? Mort, I'm, I'm not sorry. doing that. Mort, he does a good Mort. I'm sorry, I'm not going to do that today. <laughs> Jeez. I'm sorry. Um, but yeah, man. Mort. So you're good? Yeah, I, I mean, I mean, it's good playing with the veterans, right? It's good, you know, when you play. I, I play with these guys for such a long time. Gary, Gary and Sam, not so much. I'm, I'm just learning now how they play as, as musicians. And I, every time we play as a band, it sounds tighter and tighter and tighter and only gets better. So every time you are literally hearing us play, the bar is just set just a little bit more high for us so that way we can really captivate this music, which is you know a good art, a good art form for us. And uh, playing saxophone in that is no better, there's no better job in the world, really. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, I think it's great that you, know, you are a young guy and you, and you are playing with some veterans, which is, yeah. I mean, Let's face it. I mean, that's the guys who are going to teach you. You know what I mean? I'm not saying you can't make it with a band your own age, but oh yeah, no, you're, no, no. You're going to you're going to take a lot of shortcuts with these guys. That's I've been for sure. I've been playing in, in jam sessions around Long Island since I was 16 years old. Yeah. As soon as I learned how to play a scale, I was like, okay, let's see what we can let's open up a little yeah, bit. Yeah, but you have mentors <laughs> now. You can you know when you have questions at, at 25 years old, right? Yeah, 25. 25 and you know you're gonna have, you have questions and they can answer your questions. Yeah, and that's of course. That's great. You know, absolutely. You got Sam over there. I mean, you know, he's he's you he gotta be quiet, man. You're really just too loud. <laughs> and he's a drummer. <laughs> well, so Sam, yeah. who are you playing with down in South America? Uh, I went out with a couple of guys from James yeah. Brown's band. James Brown's band? Mm -hmm. Oh, because I just had a bunch of them in here. Yeah. Well, there's, TM well, Stevens played with James Brown. Do you, know, you ever yeah. hear that story? With the, TM was telling me the story about when, because uh, I, you know, I had heard so much about him, about how he would find people if they missed a note oh, or yeah. whatever. And oh. uh, so he said, I said, Is it, was he really like that? Because I'm a James Brown freak. Mm. And uh, he said, yeah. He says, and I'll forget, give you a quick story. When they were doing Living in America, mm -hmm. uh, he said, I just wanted to see him work. And he said he peeked his head out of the door, and everybody was gone except James, and he was going to do his vocals. And he's like, where are my background singers? And nobody was there. And he's uh -oh. like, where are my background singers? 
So he goes, you, you. So he goes, I don't sing, Mr. Brown. He goes, you are singing now. Get up here. So when you listen to Living in America, that's T.M. Stevens singing on the background. That's awesome. He I'm made him sing it now. Yeah, true story. Yeah. That's cool. All right, I listen. I want to get buttered up here myself, so we're going to take a quick, quick break. These guys are going to hit the stage, and they're going to take it on home with some buttered soul. So hang in there. I know you know what I mean now. Get tight. Get ready for these guys. They're going to make you feel all right. We'll be right back with the Maverick Soul. Hang in there. I never had a fourth. This is Beth. Hi. Hi. Oh, congratulations. When are you due? I'm not pregnant. Oh, look at that. Excuse me. You're totally thin. You look very sexy. For life's bleachable moments, all it takes is three quarters of a cup. One resident describes her horrifying experience when she first realized the complex was on fire. I got bronchitis. Ain't nobody got time for that. Ain't nobody got time for that. Ain't nobody got time for that. Ain't nobody got time. Ain't nobody got time. Ain't nobody got time for that. Ain't nobody got time for that. Ain't nobody got time for that. Ain't nobody got time. Ain't nobody got time. Ain't nobody got time for that. Ain't nobody got time for that. Ain't nobody got time for that. Somebody was barbecuing, barbecuing, barbecuing. I said, oh, Lord, Jesus, it's a fire. Then I ran out. I didn't grab no shoes or nothing, Jesus. I ran for my life. Ain't nobody got time for that. Clicking this thing will get us online. Well, try dragging it. Mm. Faster. You're just a mouse click away from a better way to rent movies. Blockbuster Total Access. Movies through the mail plus movies through the store. One low price. Here's the problem. We forgot to plug it in. Oh, don't even think about it. Get a free trial at your Blockbuster store or Blockbuster.com. Freshness, softness, and static control has never been easier with the Bounce Dryer Bar. I just stick it to the inside of my dryer, and I never have to remember. Oh! Old Spice Body Spray makes you smell like power! It's so powerful, it sells itself in other people's commercials! You smell like outdoor freshness. You smell like power? Yeah, I do! Power! For professional motorcycle transport and towing, think Kickstart Fabrications Motorcycle Towing. Proudly serving all of Long Island, we feature expert handling and 24-7 service. So send a limo for your toy with Kickstart Fabrications Motorcycle Towing. Brooklyn 
Brooklyn's best locks, McKen Hardware. We have three of the largest showrooms of safes on display and in stock. You can see and touch them in person instead of browsing a catalog. We carry gun and rifle safes, burglary safes, jewelry safes, fire rated from a half hour to two hour. Famous name brands. We sell guard all. We sell AMSAC. The new AMSAC touchscreen. If you're ever in need of a safe, think Brooklyn's Best, Locksmith and Hardware. Right, Lockie? That's right, Alan. We are back with the Maverick Soul. And ladies and gentlemen, I'm not wasting any time. I give you Budded Soul. Some wings, no distant roads are calling no me. You tend and 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 no time for a summer friend, no time for the love you send. Seasons change, and so did I. You need not wonder why, you need not wonder why. Time left for you. No time left for you. On my way to better no time things. Left for you. I found myself somewhere. Distant roads are calling me. You tend, tend, and and and. No time for a gentle rain. No time for my watch and chain. No time for revolving doors. No time for the killing floor. No time for the killing floor. There's no time left for you. Time left for you. On my way to better things, I found myself 
You know, music is from your soul. They say that, uh, you know, people talk about soul music, but all music is from your soul. That being said, we're going to do this next song all right now. We're going to rock it up a little bit for you. There she stood in the street, smiling from her head to her feet. I said, hey, hey, what is this now, baby, maybe, maybe she's in need of a kiss. I said, hey, hey, what's your name, baby? Maybe we can see things the same. Now don't you hurry or hesitate.
said I took a home here to my place Watching every move on her face She said, look, watch your game Are you trying to trick me and say Then I said, slow, slow, don't go so fast Don't you think that love won't last She said, love, Lord above Now you're trying to trick me and love Everything's alright, alright now Baby, 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 it's alright Now the whole time I was in there sitting on the couch, there was no sweat. Come on, let's go. No Keep sweat. Going. Give us another one. <laughs> let's do this. Uh, let's do this next one that drives all the girls crazy when we play it. Oh yeah. Well, I gotta say it. Yeah. You don't actually know it. all of you if you know this song and uh, if you care to sing it with us because we know it drives all the ladies crazy and Mikey it's all the same all in the names of chains every day seems we're wasting away another place where the faces are so cold I drive all night Just to get back home I'm a cowboy On a steel horse I ride I'm wanted Dead or alive Wanted Dead or alive Sometimes I sleep Sometimes I'm not for days The people like me Who is going separate ways Sometimes you tell the day By the bottom of that you drink In times when you're alone Oh 
you do is think I'm a cowboy On a stand horse I ride I'm wanted Dead Dead or alive Wanted Dead or Too good to us. Too yes, good to us. sir. We're just going to cut into this last one, and I, I, I'm pretty sure you're going to like it.
Beyond the palace, heavy power drones stream down the boulevard. The girls comb their hair in the rearview mirrors, and the boys try to look so hard. The amusement park rises, bowling stock gives a hollow on the beach in the mist. I wanna die with you in the on the streets tonight, in an everlasting kiss. Take a minute to calm your hair. You guys feeling all right? I said you're feeling all right. We're gonna count it off. One, two, three, four. Highways jammed with broken heels on a last train's power drive. Everybody's out on the road tonight, but there's no place left to hide. Together, Wendy, we can live with the sadness. I love you with all the madness in my soul. Oh, Sunday girl, I don't know when we're gonna go to the place where we really don't go when we're walking the sun. But till they trance like us, baby, we were born to run. Trips like us, baby. We were born to run. Come on, honey. Trips like us, baby. We were born to run. have to go to the garden these guys are playing probably playing two blocks from your house i mean it doesn't get much better than that you have bruce in the house right there <laughs> awesome bro awesome 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 band ladies and gentlemen but and soul if you get a chance to see these guys by all means go out and see these guys they're great go see them that's about it for us this week i do want to make an apology we only we, we lost two cameras and we have my man michelangelo here tonight working the cameras he did a great job we don't usually have the movement. We have three cameras working, but we only had one camera working. But I think he did a phenomenal job showing these guys what they got because you guys were awesome. I'll tell you, they were awesome. And Tommy so, was awesome. Tommy. So, Tommy. so Tommy. again, Tommy. we bring. All right, enough of that shit. <laughs> we bring you, we bring you the best here at the Maverick Soul. We'll be back next week with an unbelievable band, a band that opens for Johnny Winter. You are gonna love this band, but my God. Wasn't that great? But it's soul. Go out and see them. We'll see you next week with the Maverick Soul. Hang in there. Have a blessed week. <laughs>